Peter Parker's new mentor in Spider-Man No Way Home will of course be Doctor Strange. Now with this comes a whole new relationship to explore that's probably going to be very different than what we got between Tony Stark and Peter Parker. Now Doctor Strange himself, Benedict Cumberbatch, teases his involvement with Spider-Man in the MCU and further beyond No Way Home. So this comes at us from a brand new interview with Doctor Strange himself from The Hollywood Reporter. And they specifically try to talk a little bit more about what the future holds for Doctor Strange in his own upcoming film, Multiverse of Madness. But he goes on to talk a little bit about the setup for that film and of course his next appearance, which will be in Spider-Man No Way Home. And he specifically goes on and talks about the relationship that Doctor Strange will have with Spider-Man. And he says that if you look at the evolution of the characters, of both characters, and where they've come from, what the story has in store for us, that the two are going to have a very close relationship that's built on the history that they share, the people that they share in common, and what happens in this film that's going to set up the future. Now, of course, the dynamic of Doctor Strange and Spider-Man is more than likely going to be very different than Tony Stark and Spider-Man, and rightfully so. They're not the same characters. But also, one of the things you have to look at is the history in the comics, where Doctor Strange has teamed up with Spider-Man multiple times. Even, of course, granting him some abilities and enhancing his suit and powers and what happens with the character. So again, we're seeing elements of that and that trust that Doctor Strange has in Peter Parker. But also, you have to consider that they're not giving us the whole clear picture. And that if you look at it, there's still a lot that's unknown. And we see that Doctor Strange, yes, he's grown. But he's also very cocky of himself and his abilities, which is something that Tony Stark also had, which is obviously going to carry some of that recklessness down to the pupil. And again, if you look at Peter Parker, so far he's had two mentors who both are kind of full of themselves and think that they can do whatever they want and make no mistakes and nothing will go wrong. And then everything goes very wrong when they try to do that. So Peter will have a close relationship, but again, he's going to learn from their mistakes to not repeat the same things. You would hope. But in the interview, I definitely get the sense that Doctor Strange likes Peter Parker, but he doesn't want to tell him exactly everything, and he wants to somewhat keep him in the dark and play it off like everything's good. But also, he'll let his, uh, you know, hubris get to him, which, yeah, that's Doctor Strange, so that kind of makes sense. <laughs> 